Welcome to TotalCast with your hosts, Alexander McKegg and Jason Rigby, where humanity steps into the future and source data defines the path. Hello and welcome to TotalCast. I am your host, Alexander McKegg, and co-founder of Tartal, and I'm here with my co-host. Yeah, Jason Rigby. And uh, what we want to do is we want to talk about the ecosystem of Tartal and all the different points of function that come together to create this tool of opportunity for everyone across the globe so that we can make this monumental vision and difference that we're this impact of a positive future. And these steps will come as an education for everyone on the platform and you listening here on the video for how we open this up to the world. And we want you to become comfortable with it. And I want you to understand it just as well as we do. Yeah, so, I think it's important, um, Alex. And, and I think a question that a lot of people have asked and, and something that I've looked at when I've looked at Tartle is, what, you know, what is the need and why did you start Tartle? Yeah, no, Jason, I, that's an awesome question. So Tartle originally began as an idea of how do we take the information that all of us are creating, right? Bring it back from the individuals that were the certain entities that were aggregating all of this data. And then from that, how do we put the control in our hands and then monetize that information? Right. right. And that's a big deal. And we've had things that have come up from, say, for instance, Cambridge Analytica back in 2015 and earlier points where we've realized that our information is all out scattered on the Internet right. in all these different areas. And we didn't realize that everything we created had such a value to it. So it was our intention that when we looked at this, it's like, how do we take what we're creating, put that control back in the hands of you, the user, and then allow you to monetize that information, right? To have you get that value stream for it. And that's what was the most important thing. So that is the why of why we have Tartle, right? Oh, put the okay. value and the power back in the hands of the individual. And I think we look at these platforms, especially social media platforms, and we look at them, Alex, and we sit, and we look at us as the end user looking at them, enjoying it, but we don't understand that we're creating data. That's right. And that's our data. Yeah. How does that, and then it becomes valuable to us. How, do, how does that work? Yeah, that becomes valuable to you. So how is it that we're going to, we take this data that we create and say we do have the value stream for it. Right. How do we apply that value to our everyday life, right? Where do we see that? So when we look at Tartle and you start to take your information and you trade it on this exchange, what it does is it allows you to pull this value stream and then now that you're getting paid for this information, you can apply it to other goods and services that you otherwise didn't have the ability to do so in the first place. You, you know, know, that makes sense, yeah. And another benefit for Turtle is that because you're paid in these, these digital currencies, you have the ability to be your own bank while you're in using the system. So that means you don't have those fees. You don't have to worry about having all these assets or certain, you know, background checks or, you know, signing documentation to go open a bank. It doesn't matter where you are across the globe. Everybody has the ability to now find that value within themselves right. and then use that for those other things that we need in our everyday life. No, I love that. And I think it's important that people understand that there is value to themselves and to what they're experiencing online. Right. No. And that's, and that's, that's the vision of what we want to see. And so having Tartle as that tool for individuals to go in and be like, listen, I know what the value is now. I see what I'm doing. I can control this and I can let this information go out when I choose to do so. And then receive something back for it. Right. That's a, that's a, not only a perspective change, but it also demands respect from the other corporations that were originally using all this information on us to now be like, okay, I'm going to get it directly from the source, right? From that individual rather than getting it from all these aggregated points and assume that that's the makeup of who I am as a person. Right. That makes sense. And you know, like the vision of Tartle, when you look at what, you know, your company can do to help humanity, how does that right. look for you? Now, so Tartle, if, if you look at it, is data monetization is the first step, right? And then beyond that, what, we, what we're looking to do is design the world's best research tool. So understanding demand. So instead of us going out and creating 30 different colors of a certain device or a chair or a fabric, we can create one that people actually want. Say, for instance, your glasses, right? Right. And then beyond that, we can take medical information and you being able to transact that info helps research and that pushes it forward. So coming to a cure for cancer or Lou Gehrig's or all these other terrible, you know, end of life diseases. Right. These are things we can come to solve because we can better understand people. And we now have a centralized point where everyone can come together, 
and share this information for some sort of value so that someone on the other side can advance that research, they can advance their understanding. And altogether, there's a value that goes out on a global scale so that, that boosts the, the economic growth of everyone across the globe. And it allows them to operate in areas they otherwise wouldn't be able to operate in. Right. So somebody that may be in Singapore, their data is going to be a little bit different than somebody that may be in London. Yes. So with that, each of them have an equal opportunity. That's right. So out of the gate on Turtle, because it's anonymous exchange, everybody has equal opportunity, mm. right? Now, because they're selling their data from different points, they might have a different story to themselves, but there are some common factors between people. And when the companies that come together to buy this information or these entities find these common factors, this is the thing that moves us forward in research and understanding of who we are as human beings right. and the choices we need to make to actually evolve and progress as a society. So instead of actually taking all these, you know, data points of, you know, whether we're looking at something that we're purchasing and then there, these large corporations are having to guess, right? You're going directly to the consumer, getting accurate data. And then from there, if you have multiple streams of that, you can turn around and like you said for cancer or whatever, you, yes. know, you could see um, that accurate data could turn around and, you know, help solve that problem. Right. And because you're not guessing. That's exactly right. And this is what we're trying to do. And the first step on this is, is introducing everyone to this tool, which right. is Turtle, right? Helping them understand the benefits. And that'll start with this video podcast series, right? Getting them to come on, become comfortable and have them understand it as well as you and I so they can share this tool with everyone else on the street so that it becomes common, right? right? It becomes something we do in our everyday life. And every time we go on the system, it is one step closer to us solving our most difficult problems. And that's the most important thing. And that's why we've designed this. Ooh, I think that's awesome. Thank you. That's great. Yeah. Thank you for listening to TotalCast with your hosts, Alexander McKegg and Jason Rigby, where humanity steps into the future and source data defines the path. What's your data worth?